And that's because you can win. And I want to thank every one of you for being here today and support AB 1839. Every single one of you being here. You know, you know, you know, you know that it's the time for action. When I came up here in local theater and had an opportunity to audition in front of film, casting film, uh, cast, casting people. You remember Anne, Anne Bretman? We all, all the people in the service she provided, she provided for all of us. When I, when I came up here with so many talented actors, and I'm just starting off with actors, I mentioned so, I mean, so many great unions, the teamsters, my brother's over here, the teamsters right here. They're all in it. It's a feeling, a feeling of community. We have series that were here done here. Many got their stars in the streets of San Francisco. Right yeah. Woo! Go from 16, all of these were, there was, there was this vibrant feeling here that was happening here in San Francisco. No, it's never enough work. We're always looking for more work. But there was a sense of some sense of things changing, things happening, and the possibilities of things to come as well. What, what if, what if, we said what if, what if we looked at diversity and how it would play itself out in San Francisco had we had the work that came here, had we had the opportunity whether it's women, people of color involved in the industry. Imagine, imagine in our minds, just imagine what we could have accomplished here. And it's not about money. When we talk about those issues, it's not about money. It's about what's doing right. And talking about equity. And talking about other issues around here that we would have had the opportunity to do. Have we been able to be able to kind of feed our own imagination and create the kind of relationships and create the kind of film industry up here that could have been possible. That's one of the things. Woo! Yeah. Woo! I'm, shooting I'm, I'm shooting up in Vancouver right now. Aww. Part of that film could have been shot up in Northern California with no problem at all. I'm shooting up in, in Vancouver I had come down here, came down here after working until a quarter to two in the morning and came down here on the six o'clock flight to be with you. You know, because we know, we all know that we have to do something now. We know that we have to stand up now. And A.B. 1839 provides us with a vehicle, a vehicle to stand up and begin to fight for what's right here. When we were doing, in 2003, Walter Mosley and I got together and wrote a pilot that CBS picked up. We thought it was, we weren't shooting in Oakland. We were to shoot part of it right at, right at the base in Oakland near Chinatown. We're going to shoot a part of it where people, we were able to see the real diversity and the real communities that people lived in. And we were trying to fish, situate that in real people's lives it, and real people's issues in the city. We didn't get picked up by, C, by CBS, but that was the last time that I got here and got a chance to work in the city that I was born and raised in and still live in. I still live in Ada Ashbury. I'd love to do a film at Ada Ashbury. Angels in the outfield. What was Angels in the outfield in 1994? There's so many talented people in front of the camera, behind the camera here, who need to work, who want to, who want to use those skills. They don't need to be driving cabs. They need to be finding other things and other ways in which they can explore and use their imagination. We need to do this 
for all of us, for our communities. Imagine the community. This was a city known for its film. Steve McQueen. We know that. Yeah. You mentioned community school. And many others who worked in here and found San Francisco a place where we can get something done. Let's make it a place where we can get something done again. Let's make this state a place where we can get something done. I don't want to be going down to Mobile, Alabama. And she <laughs> That's not San Francisco. <laughs> I don't want to pretend I'm somewhere else in Baton Rouge, Louisiana. You know, or wherever you go and everything else. In fact, I want to shoot a film where, where I'm in the country and somewhere and it takes place in Baton Rouge or whatever, then okay. <laughs> but I don't want to try to make that pretend Baton Rouge is someplace else than it is. And that's because they got economic gains. Not only do they give tax incentives, but they don't pay the same wages to those behind the camera and those who work in Louisiana and Mississippi and other places as well. So we got to call the state a state. We got to talk about how do we begin to really talk about equity? How do we begin to say having a fair share of not only having incentives for filmmakers, for producers, for studios to make films here, but how they give us a better piece of the pie all the way down the line, yeah. every place. Woo! 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 Thank <laughs> you.